What's up, folks? Welcome back to Beyblade Burst. I'm your host, Michael Nightwing, and today we're unboxing this dual pack here. And I decided to bring out my Kashing Katana for you all to see just how cool it is. This is my Katana. It is awesome looking and it is beautiful. And I'm going to leave it here on the desk as we do this unboxing. 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 Also, this Katana actually has a little mini knife for a little up close and personal. Stabby, stab, stab. But yes, leave this here. All right, so we are unboxing today Vanish Cobra C7 along with Katana Mura, Mura Muramasa M7. All right, this looks amazingly dope. So let's take a look at the back real quick. The back side states that Katana is actually a stamina type and Vanish in this one is a defense type. Okay, so we have 18 stamina or 16 stamina for katana and pretty mediocre here for vanish but who cares about this let's crack this bad boy open oh yes i just used the katana to open up <laughs> oh wow that's that's lovely packaging lovely packaging use the katana to open up katana that's it that's it that's all we get in the box which is cool you know eco-friendly and all whatnot all right let's see Katana there, and we have Vanish Cobra there. Got the stat sheet, but no one cares about that. I know I don't. So, set that aside. Now, oh, crap. this goes this, right? Is that how it goes? Hold up. You, no, so Vanish gets this, this thing, and this one. And then, okay, that's the way that goes. All right, so first things first, let's do some Wang. But when I got the box of this one, when I saw it in the stores, first thing that popped into mind was Death Scyther, right? So here's the white one with the metal and then that. And it feels like it's just the exact same thing. And this one looks, oh wow, look wow, pretty much the same thing. That's insane. This would be amazing if this was done by Takira Tomi. Like Hasbro does an amazing job, in my opinion, of making these exclusive like layers that you just want to have exclusive layers and exclusive discs they don't have any exclusive drivers really well technically this is an exclusive driver but for the most part they have like amazing like hasbro only exclusives and i just love it but this is definitely like if this was oh oh this thing's gorgeous also this combo right here slaps all right so we got all right weighing that's what we're doing we're gonna weigh these things so let's do some scale practice here. Let's see. We're gonna start off with the Vanish Cobra. So we're gonna pop off the gravity ring. Now, another thing I love about Hasbro that they've been doing recently is different gravity rings. That's fantastic. Comes in at 1.42 grams. Now, don't get me wrong, I have my dislikes with Hasbro as long as well as I have my dislikes with Takira Tomy. It is what it is. Seven grams here. Got your likes and dislikes, but neither one of them pay me. So it doesn't really matter what I think, right? 25 grams, and then, ooh, assault, 5.6, and then the defense is two. All right, so in total, that's 7.63. And then we're gonna go ahead and put this one back together. I like this one, I like the, the details on it. It looks pretty cool. It's like a four-headed serpent or a four-headed cobra. Well, technically maybe two-headed, it just split twice, but. Who cares? So we got that. Oh, and then here's the QR code if you need that. I know y'all like those QRs. Anybody's still playing the game. If you're still playing the game, let me know in the comments below. I have not played it nor updated it since the last time we played together online. Now let's take a look at Katana. That looks like Rise. It's supposed to be Rise? It looks like Rise. And then, I don't know what this is supposed to be. It's very weird looking. It's an interesting driver tip, but okay. So that one's 5.57. So this looks like a very interesting quad tip. I'm interested very much so in this disc because it has big stamina feel to it. 25.78. So maybe this could be a useful disc to use in some of my Takira Tomi only combos. It seems like it comes with the 10 armor Let's give me 10 gravity ring. And then Katana is 
and Maramatsu is 7.8, or excuse me, 4.82. All right, so let's see. Put this thing back together. And in total, it comes up to be a 46.78, 45.93, and then my combo here is 75. So this thing definitely will slap around. But I think definitely, definitely an interesting little piece. So let's take a quick look in the stadium. So we're not gonna use the quad drive stadium because I do not have it here at this studio. It is actually in da -da -da -da, Nightwing's Loft, which is, this is gonna be a side note, more of a, of a thing where I'm telling you, hey, head over to my other YouTube channel, which is called Nightwing's Gaming Loft. Head over there and then follow that because I'm opening up a physical gaming loft that's gonna be the Maryland hub for Beyblade. Well, that's what we're gonna make it anyway. It's gonna be tournaments every week, invitational Beyblade tournaments. It's gonna be great, it's gonna be money prizes, all that fun stuff. You guys know how I like to play, and it's gonna be fantastic. So my stadiums are over there. So today we're using this stadium here from the plastic generation. Haha. -ha. So first let's see how Katana Momatsu does in the stadium. And that's using what it looks like rise. Pretty chill, I can respect it. Easy with the burst though, wow, that was an easy burst. Let's check out this random driver, I have no clue what it is. I don't know what it's even supposed to be. Like it might be a remake or something. But it's cool looking though, I like the way it looks. Definitely a lot of movement. So I guess that would be more of the attack driver here. An interesting movement of that. It's like more of a balance driver. But for something called Katana, I think it's important to have that. But as you see there, this thing has terrible burst resistance. Like I'm just barely touching it and it's already just bursting everywhere. So I don't have a, I have a very strong feeling this is gonna need a better like core in the middle. I did just get the red Valkyrie. So maybe that has a better core because this one is not where it's at. But we'll see how, what is this? Vanish Cobra does. So that's with the defense tip. A nice bit of movement, which is what you would want from a defensive tip to stay away from the center for those attacks. And can withstand the finger. All right, so that's good. And let's see how it does with the assault tip, which is more of an attack type tip. Nice, flat, and fast. Get on there. Stay. Stay. Good boy. All right about what you expect. Okay, so now let's put them in the stadium real quick and see how they do together against each other. So we're gonna start off using Katana since it's the stamina type. It's so weird, Vanish not being a stamina type. Okay, all right. So obviously opposite spin here. So I'm not anticipating a burst. Definitely a spin finish though. And it looks like it's actually gonna go, up. Oh, Katana took it, nice. And no movement at all from Katana. So an opposite spin at least, you don't have to worry about a burst out of this thing. Nice and stable too, I love it. All right, so now we're using the defense still. Then we're gonna do another one of these rounds. And then after that, we're gonna go ahead and switch over the armor tips. And then you know what, we're gonna put them in, uh, was it apex mode? Put them in high mode to see how they do. Nice. All right, so let's switch out the bits. So give it this thing here. And if you know what this is supposed to be, let me know, I would love to know. I bet it's gonna be something silly too. Like that's supposed to be like evolution, evolution dash or something. I'm gonna tell you right now, if it's something crazy, I wanna know. Oh, that was a just bad, no, that was just a bad launch on my part. All right, let's try that again. There we go. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Come on. Oh, nice. Oh! Oh! Katana definitely burst first. Wow. Well, that was nice, though. Katana definitely burst first. I think the spikes on this 
really did a great job of causing that burst because that was that was lovely. Wow, let's try it again. Oh, oh, big hit. Katana is not playing. There we go. There we go. Come on, let me see it. Come on, come on. Oh, Katana still won. All right, now let's go to high mode or apex mode is what I believe it's called. Okay, so now they're both in high mode. So let's see how they do there. Still using the core note, core regular. So not core plus. Oh, one hitter quitter. Wow, with the KO. KO season. Oh, good hit, good hit. Nice. Okay, okay. Then after this, we're gonna put the chips back on. Oh, all right. Definitely this, uh, I'm definitely gonna have to figure out a combo to use this in. The, it's just, it's so smooth. It's doing a great job. All right, so now we got them with the core plus mode. Oh, Vanish is coming in hard. Vanish Cobra. Katana, can you defend? Can you defend Katana? Come on. Like, I feel like Katana would probably the Bellfire Core would do amazing. Still doing well now, though, but I think it'd be even amazinger. Oh! With a burst and a hangout. Wowzers. Okay, folks, well, with that being said, uh, that's going to be the unboxing here of these two. So we have Vanish Cobra and Katana Morimatsu. So the only thing now we need to do is get the thumbnail photo. So if you guys want to hang out with that, you're more than welcome to. We're going to get this cool thumbnail. So what I'm thinking I'm going to do is I'm going to take this Katana, the miniature one, and put it straight through this way so you can see the cool... Like the cool marking on it. So put that through right about here. Also, again, if you haven't done so already, make sure you subscribe to my new YouTube channel, which is all about gaming, because it's gonna be a physical game law where you get to see all my cool games that we'll be playing. So it's gonna be eh, Call of Duty is what I'm playing right now, some Street Fighter. There we go. This thumbnail is going to be amazing. And let me know if you like, if you all like this thumbnail. Because you all are watching me do this right now. So I'm just grab the camera and take a good shot of it. So let's get like a really good angle there. I think that looks dope. Yeah. But with that being said, do me a solid favor. Subscribe to the channel. Like this video if you can. Please go home and tell your mommy lover. I appreciate you all for watching. Thank you so much. Give an amazing and beautiful day, okay? Be safe. See ya.